Hello, this is not the end crochet, and I have been wanting to make this video because I I thought that it might would be important for someone, especially if you have started crocheting pretty regular and you might have scraps left, or if you have a large enough amount left out of a skein that you might want to add to a project, that this would be very important. So the name of this video is how much yarn left in the skein by weight um, there are really good yarn calculators on the internet I think crochet world has one but the one I found that really came in handy was on this blog what's the name of the blog easy crochet now uh, it's pretty it's pretty good not too complicated or anything you just need the basic information and it'll tell you exactly how much is left in your skein but it occurred to me that if you had the following items the skein in question uh, kitchen scales a calculator notepad and pen and uh, skein yarn label that you should be able to figure this out for yourself my issue with doing the video is i didn't know where to set it up at so i'm gonna try to balance everything here on my lap in my little cubby and we'll see how that works out if not then i have to make plans to move it to a table or a countertop somewhere in the house but i think this this will work and i've done it before and come up with some calculations uh, so we just see if it's gonna work now here's my skein here are my scales here's my little calculator notepad pen and so that's Erin Fleck there's my label it's very important you need to have the label go with the skein or it might not calculate right okay what we need to do is determine how many yards per ounce and since you since we have it down to it that the, the label wherever it went is 260 yards and it was let's see if I can get it yep five ounces we need to divide this into that That will give us 52 yards per ounce. Check that, make sure. Five by five, yep, 52. Now is when we need to um, set scales to zero and weigh the yarn. That's the way. Sorry about the crossing over and everything, but I'm a little limited in space. I want to get this done. Okay, it's already where I need it to be and it's affecting it which way I tilt things so I'm just going to try to get it to go back to zero I'm going to weigh my skein 2.1 fluid ounces I 
and I'm gonna multiply that by 52 yards and this should give me how many yards is still left in that skein One hundred and nine yards point two. And that's how much is left in the skein. Now, if I want to know how much I used out of the skein, that's pretty easy. Okay, in order to do this, I need to subtract the total amount of yardage in the skein, which is 260, is way out, but to give me my total. See if I can hopefully get this to show a little better. Now, it's pretty dull. Sorry. I can see it, but I know you might not can. And that's how much I've used out of this game. It varies so that's why it's so important to have the actual label that goes with the skein okay that's how you do that I hope it has helped you and will come in handy in your crocheting endeavors So this will be converted into an Excel worksheet so that when I put in the right information, it will automatically give me what I want to know. I mean, I got a lot of scraps and I pretty much kept all my labels and I would like to know what I'm dealing with when I deal with scraps. I want to say, well, if I got... 99 yards, I know it'll make this much, or if I got 50 yards, I know it won't make but this much. That's just me. Toodles. Be blessed.